Welcome back to the wormhole, everyone. Your number one place for entertainment and fun. We're here with another Pokemon card video. So, I'm Sean. And I'm Gwen. And we're here to talk about, we got the new Pokemon Battle Academy. This came out today, as did the Pikachu V-Box. Picked this up at our local GameStop. Found this at a local Walmart. But right now, if you uh, get out and about, they should be pretty easy to get. They just came out. They should be, you know, all over the market. So, uh, we, I think, uh, started out, one of our first few videos was the Battle Academy. It was, yeah. So the I'm, first one. Yeah, I'm quite excited to crack this open and just kind of look at it. So, these are three pre-built decks. Yeah, it's always nice to see some of these pre-built decks because, for one thing, when we started this, it, it, pretty much with that first video, I had no idea how to play the game. Um, this actually does kind of help, so it's kind of what got us into playing the card game. Yes, yeah, so it is a good learning tool if you are trying to learn. It gives you three decks, you get a bit of variety, a few different levels of play style. And uh, so last time it was, I believe, Charizard, like Raichu, and Mewtwo. This time we have a Cinderace, Eevee, and a Pikachu. So it comes with what looks like another one of the playboards. See what it looks like? This is really useful because when we were playing, we used this board. I like that it has all the rules on it. Yes. Because boy, are there rules. <laughs> oh, so, what is this? Each uh, little reference? Yep, it tells you how to play each deck. Oh, that's cool. It's got a few little tips and tricks for like tag team Pokemon, GX. your V stars, your V unions. So, this would be good for keeping up with how the game evolves and changes as it moves along. Some damage counters, some other stuff. So it comes with a cool coin with your Pikachu, Eevee, and your Cinderace. Go ahead and start here with Pikachu deck. Yeah, which I noticed was a little interesting is so the last one had an advanced deck. Yes. Which was the Me Too. This one just seems like it's pre built around each hero mm -hmm. Pokemon. That is interesting. So we start here with the Pikachu V deck. So you've got a Pikachu V from Vivid Voltage. So if you're looking for a Vivid Voltage Pikachu V, there's a quick way to get one. Except they all have these little stamps. This is what I really liked about these, and this is what I uh, kind of find really cool because they're kind of indisputably a set. You know, 59, 58. But so this is a cool little electric deck. Built around your Pikachu. Just your basic cards, you know, nothing too crazy. Fly through here, but I just wanted to showcase. I do really like the uniqueness of this deck, having these little stamps. It's very similar to the, uh, what are they called? The, uh, the little, like, trainer uh, kits that come with little half decks. But. I, I don't know, seeing these, like, pre built ones really helped emphasize to me the importance of trainer cards. I, uh, didn't realize, didn't realize how important they were. Basically, you need mostly those. Yeah, so you're going to have a lot of your hops and type cards like this. Most of your rival cards are going to be your draw three. You know, you've got things like a lot of drawing cards. Like, you really want to get as many, you know, shuffle your hand, draw five cards. Like, or searching. Yep. Targeted spark, that's cool. Like, all these different moves. Healing, you know, so... It's an interesting game. I had no idea. Oh, cool. Fusion Strike Zerora. But uh, I didn't realize how much, yeah, the trainer strategy comes into it, of having the ability to identify the card you need, locate it, and get it into play as fast as possible with as much support. So we're going to start here with the Cinderace. And again, we're just going to fly through these real quick and then get into the... Uh... The good stuff. But yeah, but I just wanted to show them off. So this is a Fusion Strike Cinderace V with the little emblems. And, of course, these are going to have very similar cards when it comes to the trainers, like, you know. Yeah, they're very basic decks. Yeah, well, that's cool. Champion's Path Victini. So I always was curious about these because we'd find them in the, like, random packs. That you get the, like, 30 miscellaneous cards for, you know, five bucks at, like, a game store. And uh, I was always like, what the heck are these weird little emblems on these? So, I don't know. Have you seen a Volcarona in there? I did see a Volcarona. It was somewhere. I believe. There it is. It is a Chilling Rain Volcarona. But all in all, that's your pretty simple deck. 
the fire types, the trainers. So I, I take back what I said. There is an advanced deck. I just didn't expect it to be Eevee. Oh, <laughs> well, of course it's going to be Eevee. Everybody loves Eevee. So another cool little thing, just side note, all these decks come with their own little deck box. Nothing too special, but it's just a little something extra. And now the Eevee in this one is a promo. Oh, is it? I didn't know that. It is. Oh, it is a, a cute card. It is a Black Star Sword Shield 65. And these ones don't have the numbers, they only have the Eevee symbol. So it's really cool because back here a little. You've got the Eevee with its own little emblem stamp. So I don't know if in the future that'll ever make this card. Perfect. That's interesting. <laughs> a bunch of energies are upside down. Yeah, also, aren't those usually in the back? Usually. Who lost them? So is this like a normal dark deck? That is what it appears to be. I have no idea what's in it. But this is a cool, this is actually a pretty cool deck. Yeah. And I... missile, you flip four coins, do ten for each heads. Well, yeah, because I'm building a dark psychic. Yeah, so this was kind of packaged different than the others, where it was just kind of all together. Zorark. Yeah, Zorark, Zeroos, Sharpedos. So yeah, this is just a solid dark And dark red as well, okay. So, but I did want to show off that Eevee with the little Eevee emblem. I just thought that was kind of unique. So, I think that's pretty much it for the Battle Academy. It's just a simple little, like, here's the decks you get. There's some strategy guides, nice board. And then what else do we got today? We've got our Pikachu V box. Yes. So this did come out today as well. I didn't know it came with a Mimikyu either. Yes. Yeah, so this is, I believe, a. Uh, it is a. You know, let's just open it up and find out. But I do not believe that this Mimikyu is a promo. I think it came in the Mimikyu tin that was released last year. Yeah, I think that was a Darkness of Blaze. Slip right into here. Check this out. So I believe the Battle Academy was 20. I think the Pikachu V box is also retails for 20. Give and or take where you go. Yeah, give or take. So this comes with the Pikachu V. I'll pop that out and then the MQ, and then you've got a nice big promo card. Still not a whole lot of use for these. They don't really have a lot of value. They're just kind of the, the modern gimmick. But they're cool if you're into that. I was thinking it'd be nice if they sold frames for them. So you could like hang them, but and we've got four packs. So seeing as this is the new first V set to come out during the Brilliant Stars, comes two Brilliant Stars, two Fusion Strikes. Because you said Fusion Strike was the last one, right? Yes. That came out before Brilliant Stars? Yes, I believe so. Cool. So this is pretty much the majority of what we got going on here. The big card, the Black Star promo, the Hollow Mimikyu, and then four packs. So we also today... We also picked up some more packs, just to, you know... Just to have some actual fun with it here. We wanted to showcase the new sets as they come out, so you guys can make some decisions on whether you want to uh, pick them up yourself. But just to have some fun now that we've gone through, we also picked up a few packs for ourselves as well. Yeah, I think we... I tried to pick out my favorite ones. Ones yep. that I'm really trying to get stuff for. So, I'm excited. Yes, so, me too. So, what would I start with? I want to start with what's in... These four packs that were in the V pack. Or, me? That way we can really show this was the value of this set. I'll take that Gengar. Yep, go for it. So your pull card for Fusion Strike is the Gengar, right? Yes. All right. Alternate art VMAX. All right, so here we go. One Fusion Strike each. Let's see what we got. Interesting. Uh, my QR code is empty. Yeah, so is mine. Very How long have they been doing that? I have no idea. We're about to find out. Here we go. Pretty nice. Yeah. Nope. nope, just a gramble. Which I'm pretty sure we get. Alright, so pretty, pretty Fusion Strike, there. I believe, doesn't have the best for each speed limit anyway. Yep. So. Brilliant Stars, I want the uh, alternative art. Art kind of, right? I do, but I want I kind of want the Luminium alternative art. Really? I think it's really pretty. Let's see what we got here. Bite, the Grodel, Clink, Spiritomb, Exu, Dim, Magnar. Alright, nothing too crazy, just a clink clink. Alright. Okay. That would be too sad about some trainer cards. Mm -hmm. Killer, mm -hmm. and a. Oh, oh 
Oh, all right. Did we just pick one of these up? We did. That's funny. No. <laughs> Still though, that's awesome. It's always good to get a uh, secret or a full art card. So for this set here, you've got you know these, and we happen to get you know a rare art card. So I would say. I can't complain about a rare art, regardless. Even if we do have it or not. Yep, yeah, for the 20 bucks, I'd say it's pretty worth it. I'd say this probably makes up the difference between the what you pay for in packaging yeah. <laughs> on these bigger sets. So I'm going to keep rolling with some brilliant stars. All right. So. All right. So, what you got, Mark? I'm going to start with my two brilliant stars that we got from uh, GameStop. Do you like Bernie? Ooh, where's my... Oh, hey! Who's the top D? Alright. Nice. Alright, so we're coming with the stars. Okay, something good. Let's get that Arceus. Yeah, right? We're that Luminion, I guess. Alright, here we go. Oh! Oh my gosh! Umbreon V. And a Breland. Wow. That's right, I forget the trainer galleries go uh, where the reverse hollows go. That's really cool. Oh, yeah. So that means you can Do actually we get... No, we don't. It's a trainer gallery. Wow. That's awesome. We actually just picked up the V Max from a good friend of mine. And uh, so now we have that to go with it. Oh, where's that Torkoal came from? <laughs> Magic Torkoal. <laughs> Didn't realize I left him there. Cool, so I'm getting another Brilliant Stars. Reverse Hollow Protest, and Alright. That's all the brilliant stars I got already. Is this your last one? I think. Oh, no, I got oh, two wow. more brilliant stars because I wanted to get a few extra for. I think. So we still have a chance. Yeah? Alright, let's see what we got going on here. Alright. So I decided these were the two, the two packs that we picked out at a. Uh, was it GameStop that we got the four packs at? Yes. Oh my. Whoa. Dude. Gold Galarian Articuno. Look at that. Beautiful. I love it. I love how it's outlined in gold. Yes. 110 damage and then it's confused. That's a good attack. All right. Dude, that's awesome. Striker. Furrow Seed. I'm not sure why. I picked him. Myers. RCS Myers. We got them at Myers when we were getting groceries. That's where these two packs came from. I know. We always try to find stuff in the most random places. All right. What you got? More glowing uh, stars? Yeah. Let's see. Here we go. Another one. All right. Let's go Charizard. Come on. All right. Let's pull Claydol. Let's go Forts. Sports, V cards, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, <laughs> really green love. room. So cute though. Pinterchin. That's a fun name to say. I have to, I, <laughs> I'm pretty bad at Pokemon names, but like some of them are pretty fun to say. Alright, so this is my last one. Oh my god! Oh! It's a good gold day. Heck yeah, that's a vivid voltage. That's awesome. Wait, oh yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention to what packs I was opening. Alright. Wow, alright. So, so yeah, I got a V-Star card instead of an energy. I still don't quite know what those are used for. I know it's like something to do in the, with the way you use the V-Star cards. And just a Golurk. So that was all my brilliant stars. I've got two Evolving Skies and a Vivid Voltage left. What are you doing next? What's this one? One. Messed up the counter. This is... Vivid Voltage again. I could have just looked at the card. <laughs> Trubbish and a Lucario. Oh, that's a cool Lucario. Alright, so I'm cracking in another Vivid Voltage. I'm excited for these two Evolving Skies I got. I forgot that you grabbed a uh, Vivid Voltage as well. I grabbed a few. I'm excited for the uh, alleged reprints they're coming out with here for the trainer boxes. We managed to find the Darkness of Blues, but I have yet to see yeah. the, uh, the Voltage one yet. Let's see. I've heard rumors of it out in the wild, so... With the, oh, Metagross. Alright. Go ahead. Yes. Okay. Let's 
Clay, rose, toys. Ooh, I got saw something. Oh my Ooh. gosh, Glorian Slowbro V. I don't, do we still need him? Uh, we might. I don't remember, because he's the one that goes next to the, the one that was kicking your ass in the online, right? Is it? I'm not sure, because I don't remember. There's like some of the multiple ones that are in sets sometimes. Weirdly, he looks 3D. Yeah, he almost looks like a... So that was Darkness Blitz, I don't know if I said. Okay, cool. I've got a... Uh, this is Evolving Skies. Alright, so for Evolving Skies, I really want that Umbreon VMAX. I know. That's like the dream. Alright. What are you doing? Alright, so... Some trainers to the Ursa. Come on. This is my second to last pack. We got one more after this. Oh! Hey! Copycat. For copycat. I do like that card. Just a second. All right, this is my last one. This is the Darkness of Blaze. All right. Bravo. Pokemon Breeders Nurturing. I don't freaking use that. I don't recognize that one at all. Let's see here. Reverse Hollow Hydreigon and a Hollow <laughs> Blaziken. Ooh, heck yeah. Happy with that. <coughs> Jesus. Right. I was trying to hold that one in, but I was worried I was gonna. Blow my lungs out if I didn't load it up. Blow the audio. Cats are running. <laughs> All, right. All right, last uh, my last pack, Evolving Skies. Don't disappoint. Come on. All right, oh, here we go. All right. Oh god, I don't want to look. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta know. Oh, right, well, we're gonna see. My eyes closed. I'll know whether you sound disappointed or not if it was good. Oh, are you still not actually looking? I don't know. I don't even know what card I'm on. Okay, you're on a reverse hollow, so you got one more. Oh my gosh, another gold! Oh, hell yeah! Stormy Mountains! I don't care, I can't be disappointed. Dude, alright, I mean... Three gold cards? Yeah, that's that's pretty great. Three gold rares. Look at that. Trainer, trainer Gallery. Trainer Gallery, a V. Two of Two these. full arts. This is pretty good. Oh, pretty good day. Yeah. That was alright. I'll take it. <clears throat> wow. All right, <laughs> that's awesome. So we'll keep coming back looking for that Umbreon V Max and those uh, some more of those brilliant stars as we move around in the next packs. But I'm excited. I believe we have EV tins coming out soon. The V Heroes. Yep. There's some, yep. There's going to be uh, a Lucario set coming out soon. Oh my gosh! Yeah, the Arceus figurine box. Ar yeah. Ooh. Me and I holding out for that one. Right, and then we've also got, you know, coming up here soon, Astro Radiance in May and uh, yep. Pokemon TCG coming up over the summer. So if you guys keep tuning in, we're going to have a lot more. And we hope you guys keep coming back so we can check out all these sets we have in the future. As well as, you know, we have the occasional just fun time pulling up some packs. So thank you guys for coming. Yep, you guys know what to do. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.